Hello guys. This is our channel Facts of Nature. Today, we are going to see how to save our rivers. Rivers are essential to the well-being of both wildlife and people. Every year, rivers shrink as communities drain water that isn't replaced by precipitation, which has lessened due to climate change. Fortunately, you can do your part to save the rivers by reducing your water usage, using river-friendly products, getting involved, and urging others to make changes. No matter how small these actions may seem, they do help to reduce pressure on the rivers and create a brighter future. By reducing your water usage to save our rivers. Take quicker showers to conserve water. One easy way to conserve water is to cut down on your shower time. Practice cutting your showers down to 10 minutes, then 7, then 5. Challenge yourself to take a shorter shower every day. If you are shaving or conditioning your hair, turn off the water until you need to rinse. If you let the water run until it warms up, collect the cold water in a bucket for reuse. If you want a bath, plug the tub first instead of draining cold water. When warmer water flows, it will heat up the cold water. Turn off the water when you're not using it. Avoid letting the water run while you're brushing your teeth or shaving. Keep your hoses and faucets turned off as much as possible. When you need them, use them sparingly. Hoses in particular use a lot of excess water. Keep them off as much as possible and don't rely on them for cleaning purposes. Collect unused water for reuse. A lot of wasted water comes from showers, air conditioners, and similar sources. You can often collect this water and repurpose it. Place a few containers under the water to gather it, then reuse it to water your plants or lawn. Water from utilities is called gray water. If you plan on using it, use biodegradable cleaners as well. For example, collect the water you use while waiting for the shower to heat up. Utilize melted ice in your drinks to water plants. Fix leaky faucets. A dripping faucet not only takes water out of the rivers, but also increases your water bill. Even a small leak can use up gal 76 liters per day. If you want to help the rivers, fix leaks as soon as you notice them. Call a licensed plumber in your area if you can't fix a leak yourself. It's better than waiting.